What's happening people? Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today is... Well, it's basically... <laughs> hey! Basically, this one's birthday weekend. Um, we're on our way now to get some... Christmassy treats. This is part one of our uh, Christmas taste test. And part two is sitting right... I Guys, we're back, back from Costa. We were just trying out little Christmas, little Christmas drinks. I've got the the wonderful after eight hot chocolate. Jillian has the Terry's chocolate orange. Terry's chocolate orange. And the last one. Apologies for the bad video here. What's this one? Uh, the big purple latte. The purple one or the, the big, big purple? Purple. purple? We don't know. But there you go. We're gonna try it. So, Terry's chocolate orange, marks out of 10. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> I'm trying to taste the orange taste. I don't know if there is. Does it taste chocolatey at least? Oh, well, of course, I have chocolate. <laughs> this is hot chocolate. There's no real Terry's chocolate orange twang of it. No. It's just like I a hot. Because I have the Terry's chocolate orange with it. Well, if you just ruined this whole taste, Jillian. After 18, standard, lovely as usual. After 8 hot chocolate, let's see what happens. Again, there's too much chocolate, if that makes sense. It's not very after 80, even with an after 8 in my mouth. There's a wee hint of mint, wee hint. No, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend, you know, it's five bucks after it's fucking cheaper. <laughs> after it, one so it's not an after it in my mouth, but here, Jillian's gonna try the purple. Don't eat the purple one, just taste it, so we know. No, am I right thinking the purple one is the... Oh, yeah, but the purple sweet is the hazel nut. Is there a nut in the middle of the sweet? A lot of things I don't know why you do. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, that's the hazelnut one because you can taste it. Would that be the nicest of the ones that will help you? Hmm. Let's try it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright, that's the mm. nice snack because that's a coffee as well. Uh, I'm not used to getting hot chocolates. I'm always getting coffees. I keep looking to this side, thinking there's a camera, but the camera's actually over here, so. <laughs> so. I'll try it after you. Just... Go ahead. Oh my. What do you think? I can taste the month off that. Is, is, it... a wee, is there a wee hint off? It's nice. Is it worth the price? Well. Because we paid that. Like... Okay, very. You couldn't drink a lot of it, they're very sick and swift, so we ended up with a wee small. Yeah. It gets plenty. Yeah, they're like fucking 3 4 or something each, so. But, we've got something else to try now. Let's see. Hey guys, we've just had our our buns and our treats. What are we feeling like? We're stuffed to the gills. What about you? Is there anything in there? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're keeping the brownies for later because we are stuffed. We're we're wired to the moon here with all this sugar. And you? <laughs> are wired to the moon already? Okay.
Hey guys, welcome back to part two of our Christmas taste test. Uh, we're a bit on a sugar high from what we tasted earlier on today, the, the hot chocolates. And our little treat box from Treat Yourself. Check them guys out on Facebook. If you haven't already guessed, if you had seen it on our, our social media, After Eights is our next Christmas uh, taste test. It's been all over the news recently that they've brought out gin and tonic After Eights. So when we went to find them, we found these and we found some other flavours we didn't know they had. Obviously we have the, the old favourite, traditional, which are going to be our sort of baseline for this test. We have orange and mint, limited edition, and we have I don't know, strawberry and mint, limited edition. Smell them? It smells like Christmas in this room at the minute, it really does. It's just going to be a weird video for some of those guys around in those fetishes. I mean, I think we're going to leave the gin and tonic until last because this is the one we kind of really are looking forward to the most. Mm -hmm. If there is a sort of gin and tonic flavour of it. So, traditional one first. Little envelopes of wonderly minty chocolate thins. This lockdown is taking its toll. So, traditional after eight. Just, just tastes like Christmas. <laughs> Can't fault it. No. Original. Original. We're not saying that's the best just yet, but... Can't fault it at all. Yeah. Just tastes like Christmas. Mm. Really good. Sounds like nice and sweet after you've had a big dinner. Mm. Or before 9 o'clock in the morning on Christmas Day. Mm. With a cat here. I like my Christmas. So, strawberry or orange next? Strawberry. Strawberry flavoured, limited edition. We haven't tasted Have we tasted these? I don't no, believe we have. Them. Same again. The perfect pleasure of strawberry and mint. Uh, the, there's a waft oh, of strawberry, yeah, strawberry. Straight, strawberry straight away. Holy fuck. Ooh. It's really strawberry. Now, I think these are going to be a lot like the. Is it Quality Street has the strawberry? Oh, the strawberry Stra cream. cream or strawberry dream? Yeah, but they didn't have mint in it. No, but I mean flavour mm -hmm. strawberry ways. That's just what it smells like. Because that's a cr that's a cream, isn't it? It's like a white. The strawberry Quality Street. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Oh, that's nice. That is really nice. I didn't know strawberry and mint were like that. Mm. That is really nice. I'd say we've, we've went up a level mm. since oh. the first one. Yeah. I think it's nicer in the month. Mm. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Orange and mint, limited edition again. Is it going to be the Terry's? Well, we, uh, we tasted the Terry's chocolate orange, hot chocolate earlier, and it was. It was alright. It was so so. The two hot chocolates were so so from Costa. It was Terry's and After Eight. The After Eight was alright. Just don't eat an After Eight. They give you an After Eight so you can tell which one's which. Don't eat the sweet. Don't eat the sweet. Drink the hot chocolate and then eat the sweet because it'll just ruin it. You didn't. I couldn't mm -hmm. taste nothing mm -hmm. but, but the sweet. hot chocolate. So, dark mint chocolate without having to pee. Is there a wee message on the inside? Oh. There's not a, it's not a strong smell of strawberry. Like the strawberry. It's not a strong it's smell anyway. nice. That's actually okay. Mm. Tastes nothing like Terry. <laughs> I know it's completely different sweet, but... Uh, you were expecting a similar Every chocolate, chocolate orange, orange just tastes the same. 
Mm. Uh, that's okay. Mm. I like that. I wouldn't say it's better than the strawberry, but I thought no, the strawberry was nicer. Strawberry. It's still nice. It's still very nice. And the one we've been looking forward to the most, because this is either going to be Clash or Rotten, Gin and Tonic After Eights. This, uh, we, like I heard this on the radio. <laughs> the wind, I don't know if it's will show up on camera. It's Gen O'Clock at After Eight. It's fucking Gen O'Clock, all right. This was all over the radio because like all these different companies are bringing out their Christmas themed sweet or flavor or whatever. It just smells like dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm getting. It just tastes like a fucking after eight. There's no gin and tonic on it. No, I might, wouldn't we, rush out and buy it. We might have to eat another one at least just to try and get some flavour out of it. Well, we did rush out and buy it, you're saying? We <laughs> <laughs> rush out and buy it. <laughs> I know, but I was expecting more of a... <laughs> there's no gin. I was about to say there's no, but I think I got a little bit of it there. I mean, am I going to have to dissect it and try and get the cream out of it? No. No, I don't think there's any. No. There's no. No. Gen or tonic? There's no real flavor, no real. There's no different. Um, no. There's no. It just doesn't. Mm. No, it doesn't taste different. It just tastes. Bland. Like a normal after eight. You don't even get the minty. I can't even taste none. Yeah. We're supposed to be minty. Mm, but I don't taste it. One more. I don't think these are nice at all, but I just can't get the Not flavor. Nice, but you've just eaten three. I know, but we're trying to get the flavor. If we can get the flavor. There's very little mint, if any. The dark chocolate's nice, obviously, because it's dark chocolate, but. Mm, Hmm? No. No, there's no flavour off those at all. Very little mint and no gin or tonic mm. kind of flavour at I all. I need another strawberry one. <laughs> so, mm. originals, standard. Hope everybody's eating their originals this year. Gin and tonic, no. No. Don't go near it. It's a, it's a fad. I pick orange. I pick strawberry. I didn't realise I was holding the wrong one there. <laughs> <laughs> I pick orange. But I'd still say the strawberry's a nicer. Mm -hmm. But it's uh, just because I like an orangey what chocolate. Is, I love strawberry stuff. Everything's strawberry. <laughs> yeah. Don't go near. Have a gin and tonic. Have a real gin and tonic. And a normal after eight. Mm -hmm. And those were rotten. So there you go, that's the end of our little Christmas taste test. We've got a couple of things lined up now for the next couple of weeks. Two spicy food taste tests, which are going to be a bit scary on it. Get the toilet roll. Uh, we have an alcohol taste test, which we're doing tonight because it's somebody's birthday. Stay tuned for that one, that'll be up. Uh, it'll probably be up after this. Well, you better remember my birthday. I mean, I better remember your birthday. We're doing all this. I know. I don't even remember. No, what, your actual birthday? My actual birthday, yeah. <laughs> I'm, posting, I'm posting the fucking video on the day of your actual all birthday. Right, okay. The video's going up on her birthday, which is the 17th. Stay tuned. We'll put it up at a decent time. The Christmassy stuff, we don't know. We might hold on to closer to December and stagger that stuff. Because we have quite a few things lined up. We've got crisps we had the chocolate and the hot chocolates today and our stuff from treat yourself check those guys out on facebook i'll put up a, a link in the description below for those guys really really good really good value for money the stuff that we got that was in the start of this video um yeah so hit us up on instagram facebook 
and the, you're obviously watching this on the YouTube channel, please subscribe. It'll help us out in the long run. And uh, thanks for watching.